to the Mercedes Benz family, right? At that time. What's up, guys? It's Paulina, and welcome or welcome back to my channel. So, in today's video, I am buying a new car. I'm not gonna lie, this was already like two weeks ago, and I totally forgot to film an intro for this video, but. It is a really exciting time this day I bought my new car and let me tell you guys a little something I have had my old car for like five years so it's been a while with my car it was giving me problems like randomly sometimes I'll be driving and it would like completely just stop now I'll be pressing on the gas and it wouldn't want to go and it was like this whole thing I that is one of the reasons I wanted a new car also I was like you know what I want to upgrade I think it's time yeah guys so I am so excited to show you guys the rest of this video before just getting into everything I did want to say thank you guys so much for all you guys support all you guys love and everything because it's really thanks to you guys that I'm able to do things like this for myself i love you guys so much and your support does not go unnoticed um also i wanted to wish you guys a merry christmas i know christmas just passed but merry late christmas and happy new year to you guys i wish you guys all the best in this upcoming year i hope you guys all make the best out of it let me tell you guys a little bit about the process of getting the car actually i had told my friend Brittany, i was like you know what like i think i want to buy a new car like you want to come and help me because i really don't know about cars at all and she ended up connecting me with one of her friends his name is ryan and he helped me out in the process a lot i'm really glad i had help you guys because i feel like it would have been very scary to go by myself okay so i felt like i didn't get to finish my thought in the last clip so basically what i was saying i didn't want to put myself in that vulnerable position about like me going into the dealership and literally not knowing anything like i <laughs> i really don't know about cars about prices about literally anything in the process of getting a new car so i'm really glad that i had help with that we're getting into the vlog and show you guys the car and everything i did want to talk a little bit about some finance things and just some advice and just things that i wish i would have known like years back and things that I, I did know and i did act on and i'm sure are gonna be helpful for other people to hear about hi guys so i just wanted to do a little disclaimer of why i chose to talk about this stuff in this specific video i think this was a perfect video to like talk about these things because it's not my usual type of content and i know when people see videos like this of like oh i did this at this age or i was able to afford this at this age stuff like that they'll wonder like how you got there and what it took to get there so i thought this was the perfect opportunity to talk about some things that i've learned when it comes to finances and just things like that because i feel like it all goes hand in hand so i just wanted to do that disclaimer really quickly be smart when it comes to your money that is like the biggest advice that i have to give you guys when it comes to finance we've been thinking about getting a car before any of that i invested my money in several different places like I have money in stocks, I have money in crypto, a high yield savings account, my Roth IRA, my life insurance. And I'm going to go into a little bit of detail with all of that uh, just to give you guys a little bit of a backstory. And some of you guys already know this, but I am a first generation immigrant. I was born in Mexico and so was all my family. And we moved out here when I was two years old. So I did grow up. Sorry, I'm like out of breath. I did grow up here in the U.S., but... I feel like as Latinos, we we don't have the same foundation. We don't have the same foundation that a lot of people here in the U.S. might have. Like white people that grew up here their whole life, that have generations on generations of ancestors that were able to build up from there, you know? Like we, most of us don't have that. I think it's important to talk about in our communities and that's why I want to talk to you guys a little bit about it and just give you guys this advice to you know educate yourself on money and finances because that is so important because of course making money is very important but it's also important to be able to make your money make more money for you you know and to be able to not only make money but keep as much money as you can keep as much money and keep your money growing and growing you know it's so important i couldn't go to like my mom and dad and be like should i invest in this or what do you think about this or i can't go to them for financial questions like that because they're in the same boat as i am um they're just barely starting out and barely learning about these things and that's why i think it's so important to talk about and i am in no ways a financial expert i started making money about four years ago and just from there i've been learning slowly you know learning new things throughout the years and new ways to make my money keep on growing and just ways to be smart when it comes to my finances so i'm gonna give you guys some tips when you first make your money i know that it's so easy to just want to go and just spend it just go i'm gonna go buy this i'm gonna buy designer this i'm gonna buy this bag i'm gonna buy this car i'm gonna get all of this i'm gonna spend all my earnings on this 
it's so easy but my biggest advice is build up for yourself first have a foundation before you decide to make bigger purchases and of course it's okay to treat yourself but also make sure that you're doing things in a in a smart way you know like have a good foundation for yourself like i said there's different places where you can invest i don't know the most about stocks to be honest but i have made a good amount of money on there i have also lost money in there so it's kind of like you have to you know learn i probably haven't put in as much time learning as i should have but it's a process roth ira a roth ira you can open one i believe you have to be 18 years old or over to open one and you can invest in index funds and stuff like that in there and make your money grow as well the maximum contribution you can make per year is six thousand dollars and then you go ahead and invest that into different index funds and it just grows over time and that is like a really safe way to do it because even though it might go down a little bit it's gonna keep on growing for years and years to come and these are just things to kind of just think about for now i'm gonna put some people that i follow that have helped me and learning some of these things right here so you guys can check them out because they're the ones that are really much more knowledgeable than i am i just you know have learned some things from them and i wanted to share with you guys literally just give yourself time like slowly you don't need to learn everything overnight as long as you have that consciousness and you're you know like slowly educating yourself on these topics you're doing amazing like just by even doing that you are far ahead of a lot of people that don't really think about these things but yeah those are just a couple things that i hope will help somebody listening and then another thing i want to say is it also has so much to do with your mentality I always believed that i was going to be successful i always believed that i would be able to literally make my dream life always i always had faith in that and it has got me really really far and i know i still have so much even further to go and same for you guys what you believe is true if you believe that you're going to be successful you are going to be successful if you believe that you are not going to be successful you are not going to be successful literally the things that you tell yourself and the things that you believe are what will become true for you and i i tell this to everybody i love i tell this to everybody in my life because I, I want them to be able to succeed because I feel like sometimes we grow up with these limiting beliefs. I grew up with, you know, around people telling me like, no, you're not going to be able to do this. Um, I would have teachers like in school be like, you can't make money off of like being a YouTuber. Like, no, like you're not going to get anywhere in life. A lot of people in life try to push their limiting beliefs onto me, but I never allowed them to. I never allowed them to. I always told myself you know what you're going to be successful and it doesn't even matter what you do whatever you decide that you want to do and you want to be successful in is what you are going to be successful in i told myself that and i believe it to be 100 percent true i could decide tomorrow that i want to do something completely different and i'm going to be successful in doing that no matter what no matter what i do i am going to succeed and i know that the same thing can be true for you if that is what you believe I cannot stress this enough for you guys like your mind your mind is so powerful so 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 extremely powerful the words that you say every day are so powerful thoughts that you think when you think to yourself that you're not good enough that is very very powerful and it is just as powerful when you think that you are good enough and that you are deserving and that you're going to be able to achieve x y and z whatever it is that you want to achieve in this life and never feel discouraged never compare yourself to others because everybody's path is different everybody's path is different just because somebody is already where you want to be it doesn't mean that you're not going to get there too it doesn't mean that you're not going to achieve so many amazing things as well all of us can win all of us can get to where we want to be it is very possible for all of us to achieve our dreams. You, as long as you keep it in your head that you are going to achieve what you want to achieve and you keep that clear in your mind and you don't let any negative thoughts penetrate that, you are going to go so far. And yeah, sorry, I just got into my little motivational speaker talk, but I really, really want to, like, I cannot stress it enough. Like, I wish I could, like, drill this into everybody's head because I believe in it so, so much. But yeah, anyways, now let's get into the video. Let's get into me getting my new car. It's time. It's time! Okay, let's go. I'm gonna, I'm Ubering to Starbucks and then I'm gonna meet Ryan there and then we're gonna go from there to the dealership. Okay, hey guys. Last 10 minutes, here's the key. Do your thank thing you. and then when you guys ready, just text me. Okay, okay thank you. Right you guys, I'm I'll scared. Yeah, 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 yeah. No worries, no worries, no worries. I'm scared. <laughs> well, I need a test drive it, right? Yeah, we can. I'm asking for the thing before driving. Okay. 
You guys, so this is my car. Look at it. It's so nice. Girl, I'm scared to drive it. I'm scared. How do you even open this? Okay guys, <laughs> so this is Ryan, I told you guys, oh wait, let me, what the fuck? So I told you guys he's helping me with getting my car and right now I'm going to test drive it for the first time and I'm kind of nervous, but look, look how pretty it is. Uh, initial, initial, welcoming to the Mercedes-Benz family, right? At that time. Guys, so I... I got it. It was so fast and so easy. Also want to give a quick shout out to Alex at the Mercedes in Encino. He helped me out and took care of me when it came to getting my car. Act like you were like a YouTuber. Go. Oh, I, I, I was a YouTuber? Yeah. <laughs> so we just Why do you have such a low angle? How am I supposed to hold it? Well, when I hold it, I hold it up. Like this? Yeah. Okay, I see what you're saying. <laughs> so we just got the car. She's driving it. Trying to see how it feels, how you We're like gonna it. Go. I really like it so far. We're going to go real quick and he's going to help me take pictures. I need some for Instagram. Yeah, got you. That is going to be all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I am so, so happy about my new car. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.